Class 4A baseball championship played in Shawnee on Monday night. Tuttle facing off against Bishop McGinnis. Wacky play in the bottom of the third. Tuttle's Kyle Ebert lays down the bunt. The fighting Irish catcher and pitcher collide, and the ball squirts off towards first base. The Tigers' Ryan McIntosh tries to score, but is tagged out of the plate by McGinnis catcher Braden Klein. So the game remains scoreless. But Tuttle would proceed to load the bases before McGinnis Jr. Andrew Bowes struck out Tigers senior Corey Hawk to end the inning. In the top of the fourth, finally some scoring. And guess who? Right after pitching his way out of a jam, Bowes steps to the plate and smacks the two RBI double all the way to the fence in left center. Sophomores Kyle Ahmad and Andrew Murphy race around to score. The Irish took a 2-0 lead. The fact that someone put a run on the board got some people pretty excited. Then in the top of the sixth, sophomore Braden Klein singles up the middle off Kyle Ebert. The bobble by the center fielder allowed Pat Wood to score from second without so much as a throw. The Irish led 4-0. But the Tuttle Tigers rose up to the challenge of their rival. And in their final at bat, the infield single to second by Chris Williams brought home the Tigers' first run of the game in the way of Grant Glasser. From there, Tuttle would load the bases and bring the winning run to the plate. But Trent Scrivener popped up the pitch and Kyle Ahmad squeezed it for Bishop McGinnis' first spring baseball title since 2002. Fighting Irish win championships in football, basketball, golf, and now baseball. They don't quit. They, 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 they refuse to lose. They don't like to lose. They figured out they didn't like to lose, and they didn't lose anymore. Well, baseball, baseball wanted to get a piece of it, too. You know, success breeds success, and all of our athletic programs have done a great job, and we had to step up and, and get one along with them. It's unbelievable. It's, everybody in our school has always been winning championships, and this is finally our turn. The Irish leave everyone else green with envy, as the school claims eight titles for the year, four for the boys and four for the girls. Damon Vonno, News OK TV.